Ah, yeah. Hello. How you doing? I'm rather tired this evening, but uh, otherwise good. And how about yourself? Well, I've got a mushroom steak, some corn on the cob, and had some Alfredo pasta. I'm still eating dinner. Oh. <laughs> Mushroom steak basically has powdered dehydrated mushrooms as a dry rub. I don't like mushrooms. <laughs> hey, Nexus, why are you attacking ZGF Cobot? What does the Cobot do to you? annoyingly or booped aggressively as for those uh maps one you mentioned i need to see what one tar rain sulfuric acid uh, and acid seems to be the only one you'll have issue with I know something on this planet was causing my uh, mech to basically drain a fuel in no time flat. Mm. Oof. I need to work on upgrading my mech. <laughs> like, it's completely empty of fuel, and mm. it had a good quarter when I landed on the planet. And it went out in seconds. <laughs> Yeah, I had that when I went into some Aether Sea earlier. It sucks, especially because it has all the resources I could ever need. And... I, I can't actually mine anything because it's, the atmosphere itself is killing me. River has a way around that. You should steal it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see what I can do to assist. I know that my sale popped up saying something about uh, my mech not being suited for the environment, so... <clears throat> there are not different benefits to different chassis. Well, perhaps I'll have to look at a different chassis. For example, uh, I know one of them is very good for gas giants. I believe that's the Titan. I thought we couldn't land on a gas giant. Uh, actually, some you can. Some are stable enough. Basically, floating islands. Interesting. Yeah. Oi! I was gonna say that, jerk! You both said it at the same time. <laughs> Alright, now I'm checking all the, uh side missions to make sure they all uh, launch properly.
Hmm. I should see about giving uh, Zevi a Telebrium Stone. What's that? <laughs> yeah, it's similar to a Moonstone. So yeah. I'll become a Telebrium. Celebrion. That too. It would be a nice laser green. Unfortunately, none of the evolution stones work. Not yet. Did you check the mod? <clears throat> I don't know if they're ever uh, going to make them work, uh, because you can actually have the color and styling of any of the evolutions from the get-go. But that would be really cool as a modifier to the Franken racist tools. Oh, I um, agree. As, I, 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 I was reading up on it a little bit, and it sounded like the uh, the stones are going to be used to make armors, not used to... Uh... Basically, like, a, the Anthro Eevees are like, like a mega evolution. They can switch between different evolutions. I think the armor is going to be, like, I, I definitely think the armor is going to be themed after the e evolutions. Yeah, a Telebrion. Only they don't hurry up and I update. Think would, I think a Telebrion would be psychic electric type. No, 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 no. It's what would you have for radioactive type. would be radioactive type but of the existing elements in pokemon what would it match to i have no idea certainly not fairy poison maybe maybe poison anyways hello everyone and welcome to the stream I am Razim, and we are diving back into Starbound this evening. Get it swapped over. Huh. Surviving the elements. Well, yeah. Oh, wait, I, I need to put... That up. I forgot to block the password for my admin login last night and uh, accidentally showed it, so I had to change it. Oof. Don't want to have to change it again. I doubt anybody that watches me right now is going to, you know... It's not like it's that secure of a password anyways. <laughs> it was just something I could come up with quickly to put in here. The password is password. <laughs> Not quite that insecure. I also the least password is more secure than one two three four five. <laughs> That sounds like a pass. Looks like sounds like the combination someone would put on their suitcase luggage. No, no, no. That's always zero, 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 zero. Well, it's also the key combination for uh, Druidia's atmosphere shield. Oh yeah. <laughs> that was a great movie. <laughs> Spaceballs 2, the search for more money. Needs to happen. Fortunately, I think a lot of... Yeah, some of the important actors are actually dead now. Sad. What? Yeah. John Candy, uh, the one who played Barf, he passed away. Oh, jeez. Years ago. I didn't get much work done on the ship itself last night, Nexus. But yeah, there's so much uh, ore and stuff on this planet.
Uh, something is apparently blocking our scanners. Oh, an unknown planet. Oh, those are fun. Yeah, it's got tar rain, mild sulfuric Shine. storm, sulfuric storm, small meteorites, large meteorites, extreme heat waves, severe heat waves, and earthquakes. Acidic atmosphere. Yeah, it's the acid that's killing you. And apparently it's got a uh, <coughs> heavy presence of human life signs. Ooh, tar too. Nasty. I'm gonna have to work on mobility augments. Oh, it's gonna need mobility three. Ouch. And apparently it's got a very long day length. If that is days, then holy cr uh, like hours? Seconds. In the day? Oh, seconds, okay. What's the number? 4,765.95. Yeah, that's seconds, I believe. Okay, now I'm curious. Hello. Or, oh, hi, Nut. Hello. It's a pleasure to have Oof. you. Consider yourself yeah. fortunate, uh, Z, that I have access to Zithrasite. <laughs> Why? That's what mobility to three takes. And I don't even know if that'll work with tar. I, I, I don't know if that's, I mean, probably real life seconds, I guess, would be the day length there. Mm-hmm. I need to label these still. You found some tar on a bog planet? I guess I'll start off with some building while I await rescue. Your mech is likely not going to be of any use on that planet. But it makes mining so much easier. Yeah, not here. <laughs> not until we figure out which mech body might work. We might not even have access to that yet. Oh. Oh no, bro. Damn it, ship pet thing, would you move? Thank you. Fingers. How wide did I make this one? Oh yes, eight. All 
They may take all of the frustrated EV. Really? <laughs> you should hear some animal calls in real life. Oh, I know. There's the wolf mouse. A little thing. It hunts scorpions. <laughs> it howls at the moon for crying out loud. Well, I see why it's called a wolf mouse then. Oh, wait, I did that as four. That's right. No, kitty, that's my corn cap. Uh, I'm not aware of such a thing, Nexus. Though it would be nice. No, it just makes the Zero-G more aggressive. Oh. Either way, you know, I've got... I've got great control in Zero-G, so it's not that big a deal. I got none! Hey, Knight. Yes? I got a better lake for you to jump in. Oh? Yeah. It's made of sulfuric acid. Uh, I wouldn't say that's better. <laughs> Why not? Live a little. That wouldn't be this. That would be the opposite of living a little. Uh, you would live a little. Not a lot. All right. Uh, what, Nexus? <laughs> if you all ended up in a cartoon slash anime universe, what would it be and the one you wish not to end up stuck in? I mean, there's a very large list of anime universes that you don't want to be stuck in. Yeah. A very long list. I think he was asking for a uh, favorite versus the least favorite sort of thing. Well, I certainly wouldn't wind up in the world of Helsing. <laughs> I mean, I guess the good question is, if you can pick any enemy you can be stuck in, which one would you want to be stuck in? Now, that has some questions. Do I get to choose what kind of stuck <clears throat> in? Or do I just end up as me? Well, that is a question to pose to Nexus, I guess. It would make a big difference if you actually fit into that universe or not. And where you fit in, specifically. Yeah. It's... Like, if it was Helsing, you'd most likely just fit in as a regular human. 
but there's vampires and crazy uh, vampire Nazis. <laughs> <clears throat> Hmm, getting full choice. Kind of tough to say. Yeah, I have no idea what I'd pick. Well, I do have a... a liking of the uh, world of that time I reincarnated as a slime. <laughs> that is a fun setting. I, I mean, I wouldn't mind being in uh, Overlord if I were, you know, a, a, a high end player. Eins, you know. Honestly, I don't really watch that many cartoons or anime. Get out. <laughs> I have the power of getting an anime on my side. Did he actually leave? Yeah. I think so. I was kidding. He'll be back. He's Here like a scab. Well, if I could expand it out to games, might want to Dungeons & Dragons Online, DDO. Ah, uh, for games. Jeez. I don't know if I'd want to be in DDO. I mean, I love Dungeons & Dragons and all, but I don't know if I'd want to be in that world in Eberron I mean I would not necessarily be opposed to it like if I didn't if I were just there I would not be unhappy but it's more a matter of there's so many other places that I think would be fun. <clears throat> I kind of think the Star Ocean universe would be kind of cool to be in. I most certainly would want to avoid uh, Fantasy Star. Oh, sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, where everything... Yeah. <laughs> Both uh, PSO, PSO World, and PSO2, as well as the classic Fantasy Stars. You know what? I know which anime I'd also want to be in. Digimon. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'd say Pokemon, mm -hmm. except then I'd have to deal with Ash. <laughs> no, you might end up dealing with Red instead. Okay, if I were dealing with Red, then okay. He's the manga. Manga is completely separate from the anime. do have uh, an anime that follows like red and others it actually follows the games themselves uh, i think it's called pokemon origin all i know is it's like a mini series uh and it's red mm -hmm. is a freaking badass oh yeah in the games you actually do encounter him in some of them oh i know as a rival God damn it! Now, for Digimon, would you want to be a trainer or a Digimon? I'm not sure on that. Probably a Digimon. What about, what about for Pokemon? What about Pokemon Mystery Dungeon? Well, now Mystery Dungeon is even more fun because, you know, you get to... Pokemon. Exactly. And let me guess, you'd be an Eevee. No, Growlithe well, is my favorite. Yeah, <laughs> <clears throat> but as far as ones that you can actually 
play as as a starting one in the games than Eevee. I do like Eevee, it's just I like Growlithe more. Jolteon was like my favorite of the uh, Eevee Lucians whenever I first got the... The Classic 3? <clears throat> yep. And it's and uh, Jolteon is still kind of one of my favorite Pokemon. Electric Fox! I, what I, about I, Firefox, Flareon. <laughs> that, that, that's my, that's my favorite browser. <laughs> Furry but, trash. Uh... <laughs> it has nothing to do with the fact that it it's got a fox as a mascot. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it, it, if maybe, if if I didn't dislike how Glaceon looked, it would probably be that, though. But I just, I don't really care for how Glaceon looks. I might either be a uh, Shinx or a Pokemon I've designed called uh, a Snowpard. Lightning Ice, or Ice Lightning, the Shock Frost Pokemon. Now what if we tossed in Pokemon Fusion? That would be crazy. What is Pokemon Fusion? It's a fan game where, you know the Pokemon uh, crossing, you know, crossovers of different Pokemon to what make weird looking things? Oh god. Yeah, there's a game built around that now. And guess whose fault it is? Uh, I have no idea. Bill did it to, to see if he could, and then Team Rocket tried to steal it and caused it to blow up. Going wild, infecting random Pokemon. Whoops. Oh, in the game, it's a little yep. story thing. Mm hmm. I thought you were talking about the actual development of the game. <laughs> nope. I'm like, why the hell would I know that? <laughs> oh, so Bill's the player character? No, he's the one that does the Pokemon box. But he's... Storing your Pokemon. He's the PC, the player character. No. <laughs> Bill's the PC, <laughs> as in personal computer. Or Pokemon Center. I'm aware of what it means. Doesn't mean I can't yeah, I throw fun. I do like this design I came up with for these windows. Not to toot my own too. horn, but, you know. Hey, I appreciate it. Is there a party too. going? Yeah. River's gotta oh, invite maybe. you. Yeah. I, I I'm just I, I I'm just a sad little Eevee. I'm not important enough. <laughs> you should have said something in the game. <laughs> Take a look at my icon. Oh I noticed the uh Oh, you just changed it. Oh, wait, no, that's somebody else. I, I noticed the uh, link hat. <laughs> I was being a bard for someone else earlier. Oh. Knight, you are allowed back on voice. Oh, you are back on voice. Ah, <laughs> got you.
Well, now I'm going to have to remove him so I can say it again. Hey, look, you got crew members in. I know. Bunch of filthy layabouts. <laughs> Waiters? I really need Durasteel. Take some Duracell batteries and uh, strip the metal. I, 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 my brain hurts just from listening to that. <laughs> You'll get used to the headaches when he's around. <laughs> I don't give that many headaches. You'll get used to them. I, I, I already have, I already have one friend who. Who makes terrible puns? Emphasis on I, I, terrible. Not funny, make, just terrible. I don't make terrible yeah. puns. If they're terrible, they'd be made out of plastic. That one doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> I got one person. It was just. That wasn't even a pun. I that know, was just it wasn't an a awful pun. statement. <laughs> Not even that. It's just. What? I want EV crew members. Where do I find EVs in the game? Aizen, I'm downgrading you to a uh, NPC. Well, that's an upgrade from imaginary friend because that means I exist, at least digitally. Sure. to get the Durasteel so I can start making rails and set up my elevator. <clears throat> um, I think I farmed uh, Durasteel in one of the uh, dungeon places. I try to see. It's for fuel... Ah, there he is. <clears throat> um, Gray, was it? What was it? Uh, I think the Ancient Temple and the Sunset Raiders give. Uh, if you break down their weapons, they'll give you Dura Steel. Or River can probably give it to you. He, I'm sure he's just got crap loads of everything.
Well, if he does have any, it's not in his uh, terminal. Are you trying to steal from someone? I wasn't going to steal, though. I was just curious if he actually did. Thought if he had any Dura steel? Yeah. This place makes me lag so much. So this is a lot of stuff here. can apparently have an Urkius buddy. Alright, beam back up to my ship. debating whether or not to run the elevator through the bridge of the ship or just have an elevator on each side. Although I don't think I can go diagonal with elevators. So that may throw a wrench in that idea. I don't know. Let's see. Starbound diagonal elevators. Looks like they can connect diagonally. But I just want to start building these. Not that one. Uh, not there either. I don't know where River went. To the ocean. I also kind of want to try playing as an Avikan. 
mostly because they seem to have an actual story to their uh, character and stuff instead of just a you know like others where they're just this is this this is how it is you know you're just oh. playing this character yeah they have an actual story to them Pet, don't go running off the side, please. Here, I'll pet you. Maybe you'll come by. Or not. They're just gonna sit there. Don't they have a tether or something? Not the ship, Pet. Uh... It's not like he's gonna actually die if he jumps off. It's just I don't want him to go off the side of the ship. All right. Yeah, falling through the atmosphere would be very painful. Hey, hello, hello, hello again there, Nexus. Welcome back, Nexus. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. You missed me. Can still annoying Zim again. No, I have become immune to your attempts at annoyance. They are mere. You say that even though now. you continue to tell me to jump into a lake. Because that's just fun. Especially when the lake is made of sulfuric acid. Why not lava? Because acid is better. It, 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 it's slower and therefore more showy and therefore better. Plus, it's see through, so, you know. <laughs> Is it see through? Because when I think of sulfuric acid, I think of like those mud pits and Yellowstone. No, it's. No, it's see-through. Hi, Aizen. Hello. Yeah. Teleport gun! It's a great way to get back if you fall off a ship. No! I needed those! This is why when I'm doing major uh, construction, I actually put a platform. You're back. Below. That's <laughs> actually a good idea. Platforms are generally disposable enough. I also have a bunch of the regular volley platforms that are not slow, the... not stair. Yeah, they're the slope, not Just stair. Just tap your movement. Don't uh, keep holding it. I'm aware. <laughs> I 
Yeah, that should be far enough for now. I really need to get some Durasteel. So I can start making rails and start designing the elevator. Oh wait, it's up here that I need to go to make more of those. I mean, if River doesn't want to give you any, I can take you to, through the missions that I uh, did for Durastil. Oh, I did have admin on. When did I turn on admin? Oh, it must have been on when I came on for some reason. It was left over. It was from when you were last on. Ah. Either way, I didn't start crafting anything. It just means that I didn't lose any... Uh, food. Which I built in the uh, refrigerator, so now I have the food that I need. Whee! Okay. That sounds interesting, Nexus. Okay, that does sound fancy. rails okay I like the first image I I do too better uh, sky hooks yes please guns on rails sounds perfect for planetary defense Moving chests. Wait, what? Second to last image. A storage platform. Ooh. And many styles of rails. I don't know what the use I would have for a storage platform. But I still like the idea of it. I'm sure it has some niche use. Maybe there's loading bays. Okay, I'm adding it. Subscribing. <laughs> adding it to my pack as well. Well, actually, uh... Automatically known. No need to pick up anything to learn them anymore. They still need the... Distortion sphere tech that lights to rails like a hook? Oh. <sighs> yeah. Well, I don't see anything about compatibility, so I'm going to hope that it works with Fracken Universe. Or Zoom, if you'd rather. like. A... I'll just uh, close real quick and. Pop out, let it update. That works.
workshop content that one which number is this nine two one nine two one nine two four three two five thank you I was already navigating to it since I realized how you were doing it. Oh. Mm-hmm. You were actually going to just straight drag the uh, downloaded file. Well, I'm on my ship. Apparently you do need to run a command to get this real sphere. Whatever that is. We'll see if that's actually true, though, for Fracking Universe, because of the tech tablet. <laughs> I crashed it. Mm. Looks what? Mm. Oh. I don't see Rail Sphere. And I told it in evil. Eh, it's not that big a deal to me. All the other stuff is fun enough. Exactly. By the way, I can drop a healing zone now. That is good. I see what you mean about that first picture. Eh, first picture? On that enhanced rail thing. Ah, uh, you just looked at it. <clears throat> yep. Alright, server has it installed. Uh, could one of you let everybody with Starbound know? Have yeah, added I'll get on? it. Thank you. And I linked it. Now here's hoping that they don't all require you to have Durasteel. Oh, the, the very rails themselves require Durasteel. Oh. I can make multiple, ooh, a train of them. Yeah, three car train, five car rail train. Now well, who's calling me? I'll be back.
Oh, this is cool for those without hydropon without aeroponics. Hydroponic rail platform. It follows rails and waters cross below it. All right, I just got a call from a friend. He's in need of some help, uh, like, immediately. He doesn't have time for okay. me to go any longer. So, unfortunately, guys, that's all I'm going to be able to do for this stream tonight. However, I will be back. Uh, I'll probably just be back tomorrow. Or, not tomorrow. Uh, I'll probably stream again soon. I don't know. I'll figure out when I stream this next. <laughs> I will probably have to, I will probably just go explore this planet on offline and stuff, but I'll be sure to show you guys it on the stream at some point. Uh, if but you're yeah. on the server, I can uh, pop on to you real quick and give you that augment. Uh, I am, but I have to run, so be really fast, please. I'm logging on right now. Have a good night. He's got like a half hour, like half an hour of the. Uh... Oh wait, night. You know him. Uh, it's Silver that needs the help. But ah, uh, okay. I had the augment already built. I just hadn't given it to you. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, anyways, yeah. Uh, I will be back tomorrow with Fissifuri Dungeons and Dragons. I hope to see you all for that. Uh, Mahal is taking over as the DM, so that should be awesome. Uh, and yeah, thank you all so much for joining us. Please have a fantastic rest of your evening. Check the description. Check out our website, zgfgaming.com. Uh, we've got merch available that you can buy and support the channel with and all that good stuff. Thank you for joining and I bid you all a very fond adieu. Until next time.